it's time to get back up. Your broken pieces are going to become a beautiful mosaic. Your ashes are the material needed to create something beautiful. But first, you must arise. Don't be afraid. This time you won't be kicked back down. I know you've asked a hundred times, but the answer is in that hundred and first prayer. Many are familiar with the verse from Luke 18, which says, Nevertheless, when the Son of Man comes, will he find faith on earth? but some are not fully aware of its context. He told them a parable to the effect that they ought always to pray and not lose heart. He said, In a certain city there was a judge who neither feared God nor respected man, and there was a widow in that city who kept coming to him saying, Give me justice against my adversary. For a while he refused, but afterwards he said to himself, Though I neither fear God nor respect man, yet because this widow keeps bothering me, I will give her justice so that she will not beat me down by her continual coming. And the Lord said, Hear what the unrighteous judge says. And will not God give justice to his elect who cry to him day and night? Will he delay long over them? I tell you, he will give justice to them speedily. Nevertheless, when the Son of Man comes, Will he find faith on earth? Dear friend, he's calling out to you. He's encouraging you to call out to him again and again and again until you see the answer come. You have suffered so much injustice and so much loss and you've hurt for so very long and so deeply that you have given up getting up. You've lay on the ground like a wounded bird for so long that when you were placed in a cage you felt safe and you settled. But the cage is not your home. Freedom is your home. Your saviour has opened the door and is beckoning you to come out. Come and fly, little one. Stretch your wings again. As you fly, your strength will begin to return. As you hope again, your faith will rise. As you grow, you will realize that your strength is in him. Not only will you fly, but you will soar. You're not a sparrow, you're an eagle. Come up here above the storm. See all things from the perspective of Yahweh, the Most High. Then speak truth into your every situation and don't stop speaking until you see it become your reality. Don't give up, persist, keep asking, 